I love the new version of Google Sites. Uh, one of the things that a few years ago when it launched was greatly missing was the ability to embed items. Uh, for the longest time when you would click embed, it would only allow you to embed by URL and it was limited to certain things. And so you're very limited on what you can do. But finally, the new version of Google Sites allows you to copy and paste an embed code. And this is great if there are items that you need to embed, like for example, what if I want to embed my Twitter feed on my website? So I'm gonna go ahead and go to Twitter. I'll go ahead and show you where this example is. Um, it is a little obscure. Not everyone wants their Twitter feed on there, but this is just an example. So I'm gonna to go to my account here. I'm going to go to my settings and privacy. And in my settings and privacy, I can go over here to widgets and then you can create a widget. And so you can choose whether it's a profile, a likes, a list, a collection, a search, it just depends on what you want posted there. So if there's a hashtag, you could even do like a specific hashtag that you want posted. I'm gonna do my profile in this case, and I'm going to use my Twitter uh, address. So I'm gonna do, and I'm gonna go ahead and hit the continue button there and you have an embedded timeline or Twitter buttons. I'm gonna do an embedded timeline here. And then what you can do is you can set up other customization here. Uh, otherwise, you can just copy this existing code. For time's sake, I'm just gonna copy this code. I'm gonna go back to my Google site and I'm gonna go ahead and embed a Twitter feed here. I switch it to embed code after I hit embed and I copy and paste it in and I hit next and it's gonna show it to me and I can insert as I wish. And now this code is in here. When I am finished, then what I can do is if I want to actually see it, what I will do is I will hit preview so I can view what this would look like for my viewers. And I do have the capability of viewing all my tweets. And then what's nice also within Google Sites is that it does condense into a nice mobile view and also a tablet view and then this is desktop view i'm going to hit the x here to get back to my editing mode i'm going to go ahead and click on publish and when i do so it will be sent out to my audience